So we need to go after La Plaga. He's it, man. It's look at this. One, two, three. La Plaga. All right, what do we got here? Security destabilization. Everything. Oh, here we go. Ignacio Perez Cervantes, also known as La Plaga, the Plague. Head of security for Santa Blanca and the little brother of El Muro. El Muro had him trained well. Paid off guys in Russia's Bodark Special Forces group to teach him combat tactics. Sent him to learn killing techniques from death squads in El Salvador and Honduras. Apparently, he was a good student. His favorite subject? Cutting off a person's face, then showing it to them. Back in the day, it used to be that the criminals hit Crazy. and the good guys tried to find them. But La Plaga, he does everything he possibly can to be seen. The guy is a social media machine. He pays narco corrido bands to write songs about him. He has his own personal camera crew. This fuck even has his own YouTube channel. <laughs> La Plaga is a walking recruitment message. Young people see what he has and want it. The guys want to join him. The girls want to get wifed up. It'd almost be funny to see a guy who spends three hours a day sending dick pics. Except <laughs> half of what he posts aren't messages to his followers, but messages to his enemies. Oh my god. What a horror show. There's only one way to stop the plague from spreading. You cut it off from society, then watch it die out. La Plaga's getting ready to flee the country with his big brother. We can't let that happen. Take out La Plaga before he gets away. Oh, here we go. They've seen us. Oh, I didn't mean to come in hot like this. Here's his house. The plug is making a run for it. We kill him now so we don't have to kill him later. Move quickly, but hold up. Here's his house. Plaga's making a run for it. We kill. Hold on. That came from near the hacienda. Take cover. <coughs> Fuck is that? Weed smoke? It smells more like crack rock. Say what you will about La Plaga. Dude knows how to throw a going oh, away. Oh, skill party. points. There's somebody. Oh. <laughs> Dead troops are reinforcing them. Marking target. Watch the background. Well, that was messy as shit. The fuck is all this? Bad guys in the area. Got eyes on La Plaga. Let's take him down. Found a tunnel. I'm hearing engine noise. Let's roll. We're not letting this fucker escape, hear me? This is awesome, y'all. Tunnel's running out. The Plaga's got nowhere left to run. We start taking fire, you put him down first chance you get. Oh my god, y'all. 
Ran right into a buzzsaw here. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Thanks. Give it up, La Plaga. You got nowhere to go. Come in, mierda. I'll never give up. I was born. Plaga down. Repeat, the plague is dead. It's a matter of time before El Moro finds out his little brother's gone. Hopefully, we can deliver the news in person. Hold on. Nomad. Things are moving fast on Santa Blanca's side of the board. El Muro and El Sueño are at war. Oh, now they're gonna want me to grab his ass. After that, Muro paid Unidad to hit Sueño. Guess that didn't go so well. Not so much. So now we let these assholes wipe each other out? I wish. Unfortunately, Muro is one of our only shops at Sueño. They've been best friends since childhood. We need to know everything he knows. Got it. So we grab El Muro before Unidad slips him out of Bolivia. When you kills him. There's a bad guy here somewhere. There he is. Got a target carrying submachine guns. We good? Shit got close for a second there. All right, so we did that. Where's the next mission? The Santa Blanca Security Forces. <clears throat> Run by El Muro, childhood friend and personal bodyguard to El Sueño. El Muro means the wall, as in no one gets over it, no one gets under it, no one gets around it. SBC Security Forces recruit hard and train harder. Instructors from Israel, South Africa, Russia, and unfortunately, even the good old US of A. Polygraphs, first of every month. Pass, you pick up your paycheck. Fail? Yeah. Don't fail. Even so, <laughs> El Muro has a polygraph system of his own. These Sicarios, aka gunmen, get intense training in marksmanship, surveillance, driving. Two thirds wash out to become. Alcones. The guys who make it get assigned to various regions as enforcers, guards for labs and shipments, hitmen. Some become drivers, surveillance specialists, spies, and torturers. Just below El Muro is Santa Blanca's head Sicario, La Plaga, the plague. You may ask, how does a show-off party boy rise to be the second in command of Santa Blanca security? Yeah, uh, spoiler alert, deceased. La Plaga is El Muro's little brother. But Got him. Yourselves. He's the nastiest motherfucker on the internet, and yes, I have been on 4chan. Don't worry, you'll see what I'm talking about. Yeah, he gone. El Muro was outmanned and outgunned, and he knew it. What do you do when you don't have an army and you need one? You buy one. Every officer, like every prostitute, has a price. Give it an sueño. <clears throat> it was the right move. I would have done the same thing. But El Muro forgot. Fear is always worth more than money. Our security infrastructure was being attacked. It made me question if La Plaga, our head sicario, was up to the task, or if he was too distracted with social media antics. Are you too busy chasing pussy on the internet to do your fucking job? <laughs> or is fucking your job? No, Hefe. He's my brother, Sueño. I will keep him in line. La Plaga got the message too well. He doubled down. Whoever is behind this, know that we will find you. Know that for every one of us you kill, we will kill ten civilians at random. There is no such thing as innocent to me. The little pendejo had no idea how much damage he had just caused. La Plaga's response to the attacks proved he did not understand that the most basic function of a drug trafficking organization is to make money. What does your father do? He's a Alcon. A lookout? See? He hasn't been doing his job, has he? I don't know. 
killing innocent people does not help you. Just the opposite. It alienates the people you need most. It sends them into the arms of your enemies. Who is really your brother? Tu carnal? The man you grew up with? Fought with? Bled with? Grew rich with? Or some guy whose mother got fucked by your father? La Plaga has gone too far. You know what you must do. I thought it was only fair to let Del Muro take care of his little brother. He would do it quickly, mercifully. Nothing like what I saw in the videos. I am not my brother's keeper. That's the Bible. That's God. Run. El Muro chose to go against the word of God. El Muro was going to try to kill me, just as I was going to kill him. Black is for vengeance. White is for safety. Gold is for success. Ahora, I ask you, how can any saint grant contradictory prayers from two different men? It has been my experience that gods always side with the man who has the most money, the most men, and the most power. I had lost the one man I could always trust, mi hermano. How many men would be more loyal to him than to me? How much power would he take? Would that be enough for him to take me out? I would always have an advantage, though. I grew up with the man. I knew how his mind worked. I knew his next move before he did. <laughs> I just had to be patient. Francisco Ricardo Munguia. El Muro. The wall. The wall between me and my enemies. The wall between me and death. We were born hours apart in the same village. As boys, we were as poor as the rats that scrambled across our dirt floor. Our huts in the shadows of the hilltop mansions, where the narco bosses lived like conquerors. El Muro took a different path. He joined the army. Special forces. He rose through the ranks, helped to protect the local narcos, was paid in cocaine and money along with promotions. When we met again, Francisco, hermano, why are you still in the army? You and me together, we could rule. We will protect each other, as we did when we were boys. We will share, like brothers. El Muro's turned on El Sueño, and now the cartel wants him dead. Get to him and bring him in before he disappears. 15,000 kilometers. Dang, I was going to take this Lambo. All right. Where the hell is he? Way up here? All right, Media Luna. That's where we were. <laughs> All right, I might have to grab him. I don't know if I can kill him. Alright, we're gonna take the chopper. Get to the chopper! I'll fly. Alright, good to go. This is that place. Oh my god, he's in here? Okay, that's interesting. Oh no, 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 I've not been in here. I was in a different base. Ah, uh, is this that base? No, this is that base. This is that air base. He's in here? Yeah, we busted in this place before. Alright, that's interesting. Oh no, no. I've switched seats there for a minute. Oh my god, I I jumped there. out. I exited. They're on alert. What the hell's happening? 
Sansa Blanca is attacking Unidad. What? That's kind of strange. Oh. Oh, okay, because... El Muro's Unidad buddies are training shots with Santa Blanca. All right, we go in and we find El Muro. I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. Unidad chopper, stay low. Chopper, down, down. So where is this guy? Amuro's on the move. Let's get the motherfucker. We need him alive. I say again, we need that HVT alive. Where is he? Got another tango. Heads up, Sam. I'm engaging tangos. We need a vehicle. Oh my god, he was right there. Oh, and he's getting away now. <sighs> Come on guys, hurry up. Back off, puto! 
Get your fucking hands off me! Ding, got a mother! Oh my god, this is that base! I need a vehicle. Target down. Grenade, move, move, move! We got a sniper, get down! Grenade, move! Oh my god, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh shit. Damn it, the cartel sent Reed Morty to engage. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Wow, what's going to happen here? Holy shit, are we going to have to go back and do this all over again? Oh my god. Wow. Wow. I almost had him to the safe house. Oh my god. But we ran into another convoy. It was like a fuel convoy or something, and then they lit us up. If it wasn't for them, we'd have been fine. Oh no. Oh, we gotta start all over again. Wow. That's crazy. Alright. Well, you know what? Let me try to... I gotta try to get that guy into a friggin' vehicle. Like, I'm quickly. Pilot. I wonder if there's a way I could... I'm in. Let's oh, man. Oh. Hey, man, try to take us off some sweet jumps, alright? You know, I should just land right there on the friggin' base, is what I should do. Instead of screwing around. What about right here? Amuro's on the move. Let's get the motherfucker. Wait. They got control we fire on these shitheads. Go, motherfucker. Oh 
Oh my god, go, 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 hurry up! Oh my god. This dude's gonna get too far. Hurry up, guys. Somebody wake me up. Oh my god, he's too far. And they're not waking me up. Oh. Well, that was pretty pathetic. Man, I wish there was a way for us to get to that vehicle. Because if I could intercept him before he... Uh, gets in that vehicle that would be wonderful so i could grab his ass and shove him in myself and take off but that's the trick is is like how the hell do i get down there maybe i could parachute down to him or something i got it i'll fly Dad bird approaching, stay down. Let's go, let's go. Engaging. Oh my god, he left. Heads up, Santa Blanca's here. What about this helicopter, maybe? Could I take this thing? Fuck, no! Get out! Get out! I need to drive! Switch seats, you idiot! Get out! Hurry up, hurry up! Go! Go, go, go! Grenade. Let's get back to it. Let's get the motherfucker. We need him alive. I say again, we need that HVT alive. Can't freaking shoot it, can I? Alright. They're LT trying to run. Come on. Go. Come here, fuck face. Back off, puto! Get your fucking hands off me! Ding the mother! They're shooting old ladies out there. Rebels have gunned down Madre Coca and her entourage outside her home. In a rebel guy. truck. This is hilarious. Damn, I know if I you were smart, you stopped right here. Put a bullet in my brain and go about your fucking business. Yeah, that's what I'd like to do. 
Isn't every day we meet a genuine Billy badass? You got well, yeah. so I'll give you that. Or you pendejos are just a speed bump on my way to killing a sueño. Two men like you being friends, you all had to know one day you were gonna try to kill each other. Maybe. True amigos are a rare thing in this line of work. But you can always count on blood. A huevo. Between me, jefe, mi hermano, the choice will always be mi hermano. I'm gonna skin that pendejo sueño and I'm gonna hang his fucking face on the wall. Or like yeah? A trophy, you know? Yeah. How do you like my hat? But you. I ain't gonna take no trophy when I kill you. You ain't worth it. We're looking good, y'all. Think that all worked out. Parachuting. Who knew? But then again, I don't know if it was necessarily the parachuting because uh, I ended up having to steal an Apache helicopter and blowing his vehicle up practically. I, I, that could have killed him. I was worried that, that we were going to mission fail because I was going to kill him in that. But it disabled the vehicle. I guess that makes sense, though. If it was a Jeep, it probably would have killed him. But because he was in an armored truck, that kind of saved him. You know, just disabled the vehicle. That's what I was trying to do, shooting the tires out and all that, but that didn't seem to disable it enough where he's still able to drive it. Oh, shit. Wow, y'all. We're going to deliver this fool, and it's going to be time for El Sueño. That is all that's left after this deal. This is your man in the know, his nose in the blow, DJ Betty. Oh, shit, Narco you fucking idiot. Flash. Well, I guess that was kind of my fault. The master in the art of making corpses disappear has disappeared himself. Word on the street is that El Bozolero put up a hell of a fight. But he was snatched from his soup kitchen before any nearby sicarios could swoop in and rescue him. El Bozolero, if you're listening, keep your mouth shut. Because we're gonna find you, and hey, wait, it's up to you if it's a rescue or a hit. Stay you ain't finding shit. Perico, because next up, my favorite hour of the day, DJ Perico's non-stop lambada hour. Ciao! All these fools we snatched, they're in black sites in other countries. Because the renditioning is, uh, we would never bring them back to the U.S. because it's illegal here. So if law enforcement ever found someone we'd renditioned in the U.S. with us, like U.S. torturing the guy for questioning, everyone gets in trouble. But if it happens in another country, you always know how to dream. But if it happens in another country where they don't have rules against that shit, then uh, it's all good. There we go. Oh my god, the darks are so dark. Do you have anything interesting to say? He's an angry guy, that's for sure. I see what you mean. You want some vengeance against Sueño? I am the means and the way. You just have to start talking. Every word you say is a nail in his coffin. This is why you keep me alive? It is muy pendeja. Tu gente killed my brother. Shed my blood in this pinche fucking Bolivian wasteland. I don't even have his goddamn body. Now you expect me to help you take down my best friend? What fucking planet do you think you're on? Helping us nab Sueño is protecting yourself. Why would I do that to him? To myself? Ubicate vieja. We are men out here in the wild. We don't play these pinches moritos games. I respect Sueño. And if I'm going to respect myself, I'm gonna put him down with my own bullet. 
de mi fusca cabrona. And now, I got a bullet for you too, Karen Bowman. <laughs> El Miro captured. Holy cow, y'all. My security forces were shattered. I was a king without an army. My generals were dead or captured. I had no defenses, no armor. What use was a gun without a loyal hand to hold it? I had lost the only man I ever considered a friend. And when I asked my partners in Mexico for more sicarios, they refused. I would try to recruit from the gangs in El Salvador and Honduras. One man's war zone is another man's talent pool. But it would take time to train them, to cultivate them. Time I would spend with a target on my back, waiting for someone else to come for the crown. Look at this, y'all. Look at this map. They're all gone. All right, y'all. Well, we did it. We did it. Please subscribe to the channel. Give me a like. Have a good night. Thanks for joining me. Please subscribe to my channel. Peace.